Alright guys, welcome back to ARK Survival Evolved Episode 16. So we've been just dealing with all kinds of... Yeah, double wave, we get a double wave this episode. But we've been dealing with all kinds of audio issues, like tons of audio issues. So, yesterday, you'll notice, I'm sure you can already tell, we got sushi back. So late last night I was filming and we went and found Fishy, which was a level 96 female Megalodon. And we used Fishy to go get Sushi, to rescue Sushi. The only problem was, was the audio was not working. So I was having some problems with some drivers. Um, I'd accidentally switched over to my motherboard driver. I wasn't using the sound card driver and ugh, it was a nightmare. But we got it sorted today, so now we're back at it. We are back at the ARC, and hopefully our audio is going to get significantly better because we switched over to the proper drivers and yada, yada, yada. So let's go. Let's start the day and see what we're going to do. Okay, guys, so we have grabbed Green Lantern and we are headed to a cave. Now I know there's one down south and I know there's one towards the mountains. I'm not really sure which one I'm gonna go to but we're gonna go ahead and go to a cave and we're gonna go look for that new tame. I've got a bunch of spoiled meat. I heard that's what they eat. And we're gonna go try and find that little centipede thing. I think that would be awesome. So hopefully we can get it pick it up and uh, you know I've never been in a cave anyway so this should be pretty fun so when we get there I will come back and we will try and catch ourselves a centipede and maybe a dung beetle if we're lucky <gasps> Ooh, is that a purple or a red I can't tell I think it's purple okay all right I'll be back guys okay here we go we're coming up on a cave you guys I love this little location <laughs> look at that sarco he's taking a little sarco bath let's look at it what level is it Move out of my way. Oh, there he was. What, what level is he? Oh, he's only level four. Okay, this is going to be the cave we are going to go into. I think this is one of the newer caves. Uh, it's right next to, right here. Man, I love this location. It's like a little oasis. So cool. Man, there's so many cool locations in this game. It's insane. All right, so let's get in here. We will set our Quetzal down. That should be good. Oh, let's get rid of that. Put our Quetzal on. We're on passive right now. I don't know if that's a good idea, though. What do you guys think? Should I just take our Quetzal and toss him up in the air a little bit? Let's do that. No, he'll come and land anyways, though. We'll just leave him here. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. We won't go too deep into the cave. I should probably... Oh, you little... Those little buggers. Well, we'll figure it out. I think I'm going to make a torch real quick, and then we'll head in. So give me a moment. Okay, guys. Here we go. Into... What? Can we not fit in this cave? <gasps> oh, no. This one's too small. Can you fit in here if I'm not riding on you? I don't want you to get stuck. Oh, you can't make it. Nuts. Well, you know what? You can stay here. <clears throat> I got an idea. We are going to put you on follow on Wanda. That way you can protect Wanda. And you're on neutral. Perfect. So if either of them get hit, he'll stick near Wanda. Wanda's on passive. I'm going in, guys. I am going in. I've never been in a cave before, so hopefully I don't get lost. What's wrong with me? Oh, I'm hot. Oh, no. Oh, no. Take off the clothes. Take off the clothes. Nutter butter. We're still hot. Oh, goodness gracious. We're taking damage because it's so hot in this cave. Nuts. Does it get cooler? I got to get out of here. We might have to find a different cave, guys. This is crazy. 
Wow! How do you go in there without getting so hot? Ah, uh, the struggle is real. Okay, well I will figure this out and I will be right back. As we got a little, whoops. Okay guys, we got a little bit of a problem here. So they just released released the 240 patch, or actually 240.1. And are you ready for this? It's not cooking. Wow, that was one of my children <laughs> yelling. But anyways, it's not cooking. The fire does not cook the meat. So I can't cook meat right now. Now what I've been hearing is official servers are working fine. It's only unofficial servers that aren't working. And it's usually if you have mods. Well, I have the stacking mod. That's the only one I think it would be. I have stacking and I have no clipping. And so I think stacking might be causing the problem. Well, if I remove that mod, guys, we got a problem. We lose everything that is stacked. Everything that's stacked like this, we lose it. It just disappears. I've seen it happen on another server before. So I'm like, oh, no. We can't cook food right now. This is terrible. Okay, guys, so I have a whole bunch of already cooked food. So I ran back, picked it up. And now we're going to head back to the cave. Hopefully, by the time I start running low on that cooked food, they fix... I'm guessing it's one of the mods is going to have to fix the mod itself. I don't think it's Ark, but who knows, guys? Who knows? So let's head back to the central cave and start spelunking. Okay, so we're going to leave Wanda here. We're going to put her on neutral. Hopefully she doesn't wander too far. Otherwise, we could be in quite a bit of trouble. She should be safe. Keyword should. And let's head in. Oh man. Oh, a little bit of lag there. Here we go. Deep into the heart of the cave. There's a bat already. And a scorpion. Oh man. Look at all these guys. Look at all these guys. Turn around. Get it. You know what? I think let's do it the easy way. Come at me, bro. Come at me. <laughs> Did they drop anything cool? Nope. They don't. Alright, you just come with me. We'll do it this way. Just don't get too crazy, okay there, Green Lantern? I don't need you getting lost. You know what? I'm going to ride you unless we run into anything. Oh, man. I just want to find one of those centipede things. That would be so cool. I've got decent armor on. I mean, it's not the best. It's nothing super special. So it should work for us, though. Oh, yeah, you're toast. You're toast. You're toast. Yeah, come on, you guys. Come on, bring it on. We got bats, we got all kinds of stuff. Oh man. <laughs> oh yeah. Nobody can stand a chance. Nobody stands a chance. This guy's pretty tough. Man, level 76. Oh, we got spiders. Oh man, you guys. This is gonna get dangerous. Oh, man, snakes! Oh, goodness gracious, you guys, what have we done? This may have been a bad idea. All the spawns, all the spawns. Our torpor is still doing fine. These guys are not even hurting us. Yeah, you better run, snake. Okay, how's our health? We're just doing okay. We'll pump up our health in a second here. Let's kill this snake as well. Titan boas. We're gonna get all the levels in here, you guys. All the levels. Man, these things are crazy. Craziness. I should have wore bug repellent or something. Man. <laughs> this is so fun though. Look at that. Get wrecked! More melee damage. 
All right, let's let's boost up our health a little bit because we don't want to let ourselves get too low. That could be a very, 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 very bad thing. Weight, we're still doing okay on weight. Oh, click spam, click spam. Okay, guys, well, I'm going to make my way a little deeper in. Nah, I'll, let, I'll keep filming. I'll keep filming. We'll just watch this. Let's see how far we can get because I just want to find one of those little centipede dudes. How's my torpor looking? Not too bad. Gosh, that was crazy how many guys were in there. Oh, here's another boa. What's that on the ground there? Oh, a dung beetle, you guys. I don't have any dung, though. Bummer. I wish I had some. Here, you s stay right there. Let's go up and see if anyone pooed up here. Nope, nobody pooed. Maybe he'll poo because I got off of him. Ah, I pooed. That'll work. Not the best, though. Don't you have to poo at all? Look at it. Look at the dung beetle. Look at it, guys. Press E to feed to meet to tame. <gasps> We're going to get ourselves a dung beetle. Yes! So cool. It's only level 8. I forgot they take their like worst thing that you can give them is the uh, rotten meat. So that'll work. That'll totally work. How are you doing? Got a little bit of that. Drop. So many items. Cool. Look at all that chitin. Thousand chitin already. My goodness. Are you ready to eat again? No, not yet. More bats down there. Titan boa. Man, you guys, that was insane. It's only a level 8, but I don't think that matters. I'll have to look into it because I'm not an expert, but you can feed them. <gasps> oh no, did I make you angry? I made him angry. I made him angry. Let's just drag him out because we want to get a dung beetle. That'll be really cool. takes like quite a few minutes when you get them angry. I was too close. Are you coming little buddy? Oh yeah he's coming. He's coming. Come on. Oh maybe he's done. Let's go check. Let's go check. Can we sneak up behind him? Oh, I made him angry. No, 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 cat. Cat, don't kill the dung beetle. Oh, cat, you turd burglar. We'll have to find another one. That's okay, we will. Flippin' cat. What's your name again? Green Lantern, that's right. Come on, bat. Here we go again. Let's wreck some dudes. It is essential to have a good mount coming in this place. My goodness. Look at all those scorpions down there. Oh, more titan boas, more scorpions. Ooh, that's a pretty high scorpion too. Just sit here and just wreck them. There's another dung beetle down there. We'll go for that guy again. I've heard that pulling him out of the cave is pretty smart, too. Man. Get out of here, bat. You too, scorpion. We're gonna have to bump up our health again in a minute. There we go. I think we're actually gonna put a level into... Man. This is getting... How's our health? Okay. These bats, man, they really do work. Okay, let's do, let's just pump a few points into health because we're getting a little low. Spam click this action. 
they're all stuck there, which is good. Very, very good for us. Let's get our health up a little higher. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Maybe we'll get our health over 3,000 or something like that in here. Damage needs to keep going up too. But not too bad. Okay, that'll work for now. Torpor is not too bad. It's only a level 20. The spiders go down pretty quick. Yeah, run away. Oh, this is so cool. Alright guys, so I'm just going to keep making my way in here. And I'll bring you guys back. We did it! We got ourselves a dung beetle. Let's get this guy out of here. Poo machine. Gender NA. Alright, you go on neutral. Whoop. And then follow us out of here. Let's get out of here. We're going to take him out and put him next to our Quetzal because this may be quite difficult. We'll see. Come on, Dung Beetle. Oh, he's so slow. Oh my goodness, this is going to be a nightmare. Come on, buddy, hurry up. I don't know if I want to wait this long. My goodness. But it's super important because basically you put poo in their inventory and they turn it into oil and they turn it into um, fertilizer. You get both oil and fertilizer for poo, which is awesome. If you can get three or four of these guys going, you don't have to go farm oil and fertilizer anymore. Come on, buddy. You are so slow. He is so slow. I'm going to try and grab a couple of these. If I can get them on the back of our Quetzal, we can just fly them home really easily. But pathing them out of here is not easy. Come on, buddy. Come on. That's a little poo machine. Okay, you're doing good. You're doing good. We got a dung beetle. How freaking cool is that, guys? Awesome. All right. Well, when I get him out, I'll bring, I'll come back. I'm going to head back into the cave. I think I'm going to try and toss him on the back of the Quetzal. I'll jump him off a cliff or something. I don't know how I'm going to do it. I'll figure it out. But I'll be back. All right, guys. Here we are. Bottom of the central cave. Artifact of the Clever. Cool. Very cool. Man, not a lot of great loot. I mean, I found that one green drop, but I've heard that the central cave doesn't have the best loot. Now we just got to find our way out of here. I didn't get that dung beetle out. Oh man, this is, this is crazy. That dung beetle would not path out the exit. It was driving me nuts. So I just left him up there. He might be there when we get back. Who knows? I'll have to figure out something. But man... This little green lantern is wrecking in here. So strong. Look at this. Level 215. Just doing fantastic. I'm really going to have to mate boost this one. And, and just mate it in general. It would be so good. Let's kill some more of these guys. Get these onyxes out of here. So strong. My goodness. So yeah, we're, we're going to keep working our way through, just cruising around the cave. I know there's a Sarko down there in the water in the middle, but that shouldn't be a problem because it's only level 4. Oh, here comes more snakes, more titan boas. These things die really fast. And nothing can hang. Nothing can hang against the Green Lantern. He's just so strong. So strong. Look at this. Boom. Done. Get out of here, Titan Boa. Done. So awesome. Let's do a little bit more health. That'll work. But we're doing fantastic. So yeah, we're going to work our way out of here. I don't really think there's anything else in here I want. And I didn't find any of those little, little uh, centipede dudes. I'll have to look and see where they're located because I'm not quite sure. 
but we'll work our way out. Yes, we got him. This little curve in this cave was horrible, and we getting him out. Such a pain. Come on, poo machine. Finally. Did he make us anything? We should check. Not yet, but there's a little poo in there. Come on, poo machine, let's go. Oh, man, the FPS is really bad in here. Come on, little dude. All right, we're going to get him out, get him on the Quetzal, and get back to our base. We've got to find where these centipedes are. All right, guys, so here's what we're going to do. I tried a couple times already and haven't done too well at it, but we are going to jump onto Wanda's back. Ah, too far. Too far, too far. We will get it. We are going to land on Wanda's back, maybe from right here. Oh, too far. I'm going to have to move Wanda away a little bit. What about right here? There it is, there it is. Yes. Perfect. No, we don't need to search anything. You just stay right there, and you're all going to go passive. And then Wanda will pick up our little friend here. Oh, man, look at this. Look at it. Oh, come on, Wanda. What is your deal? Oh, we got it. We got it. Poo machine. Poo machine. And we're ready to go. Green Lantern and Poo Machine and all kinds of weird glitchy glitches. All right, guys, so I'm heading back. I had to do two trips because for some reason Green Lantern on the back of Wanda was causing some weird issues. So I just dropped Green Lantern up here on this uh, on the main mountain and I'm going to run back and grab him. But something I wanted to say, if anyone is interested in joining me on this server, let me know. I'm looking for a few, few people. It's a 20 person server. We get a few people on here and, you know, dink around together. That would be just cool. So anybody that wants to join me on this server, feel free to let me know and we can talk about it. I do want to get to a point where we have a couple tribes on here and maybe we can do some tribe wars and stuff. That would be pretty fun. But uh, at least at the beginning, you know, a little PvE-ish. But anyways, guys, again, if you want to join the server, shoot me a comment or send me a message let me know and uh, yeah we can talk a little bit about it that would be cool all right guys so cool so here's our little pen for poo machine and right next to him is the little poo box where we're gonna store all of our poo now it spoils pretty fast but you know if I'm online and I'm here I can pick a bunch of stuff up if he can't carry anymore which he can't we need to get his weight up there but for some reason it's not letting him take any more but anyways yeah he's got his little spot enable wandering and he converts the poo every 15 minutes into oil and fertilizer which is really cool check it out guys check it out 116 male rex oh come on come on and a scorpion get out of here scorpion We are going to drag this guy all the way back to our base. This is going to be good. Come on, come on. Stay interested. Stay interested. Sure. Eat the turtle. I don't care. Stay interested. Oh, no. Come on. We're going for this 116. We are going to get this Rex. This is going to be great. I was looking for Quetzals. Wasn't having too much luck. So let's go ahead and just get this Rex instead. We need the male. We already have the female. This is going to be awesome. All right, guys. Well, we're putting some shots in him right now. He's stuck in the same spot as the, as uh, Rexy. So we're just going to keep putting shots in him. We'll head back and pick up some more Narc arrows because we have a ton made. So, yeah, we should be able to take this guy down. Oh, and we'll probably have to repair our crossbow as well. He can't seem to get across this little river here, which is fine by me. Come on, don't go too far. But I'll pump him full a few more of these. Oh, this might be good, because I want him to come closer to our base. Let's see. Yeah, perfect, perfect, perfect. All right, guys. We'll keep dragging him. We are going to try to do the whole shoot from the Quetzal thing see if that'll work for us. We might need to get a little bit lower. 
and aim a little bit better here. Let's see. Oh, I did get him. It hit him. Okay, let's let's get a little lower. Okay, stop. Let's see if we can get this guy to move your head, Quetzal. Just come sit right underneath us. There we go. Perfect. Perfect, you guys. Quetzals are invaluable. Invaluable. This is going to be an excellent tame. I wonder... I mean, this is a safe area. Nice. And he's just going to sit here. <laughs> just plinking away, plinking away. All right, well, in about another hundred or so of these, we'll have ourselves an unconscious T-Rex. Oh, we'll get close to the edge and headshot. Awesome. Oh, yeah. This is so good. And I have... Oh, no, that's it. That is it. Ooh, almost fell. Cool, guys, cool. And we're right next to our base. This is so good. He's unconscious. Yeah, he's going to get a nice little stat boost. This is going to be a good looking, good looking T-Rex. Look at this guy. Taking a little happy nappy. Kind of scratched up, kind of bloody. Got a lot of arrows sticking out of his little cranium doing great so yeah that's the way to do it guys the quetzal that is your go-to workhorse my goodness best investment ever it takes time to get it it's hard to get it but it is so totally worth every second to get it so we're going to go ahead and let him just kind of starve out and i'll probably come back in about 15 20 minutes or so just gonna hang out here and we will get him tamed. We're just gonna do prime meat tame. It won't be kibble or anything because of course we don't have enough. I think it's stego that they use. No, it's not stego. I don't remember. But or it's art it's quetzal. We don't have any quetzal eggs. So we'll just get this guy snoozing and catch him catch him in a bit. Okay guys, here we go. Yeah, it's about to pop. Rusty the Rex. Look at this guy. He's going to be so cool. Whoa, frame rate. Yeesh. Get out of his head there, go grocery getter. Jeez, picking his eyes out. Come on. There it is. Rusty. So cool. Look at him. He is just awesome. All right, let's go. Access inventory. Put a saddle on him. Oh, yeah. Rusty the Rex. Look at this guy. Let's check his stats. Let's see what his stats are. 6,800 health, 1,260 stamina, 660 weight. Not bad. His melee damage, man, just not breaking that 300%. But we'll get him leveled up. Awesome. Movement speed still low. But that's okay. Alright. There we go. There we go. There we go. And one bite. Oh, that poor dodo. One bite. Sweet. Let's close the gate. Actually, you know what, guys? We're going to go. We're going to start attacking. Let's go attack some dudes. Get a couple levels. Rusty deserves it. He's had a hard day. Getting knocked out by some random guy. He's he's had a rough one. We'll start with this dodo. <laughs> Two dodos is a level. And you know exactly where it's going, guys. It's going straight into melee. That's all we're going to do. Nothing but melee for a little bit. Kill this turtle. Get it. Get it. Strongest turtle ever. Melee. Oh, two. Nice. 
I love the fact that his stamina is not too bad. His stamina is pretty decent. Oh, man, he's just crushing. Just crushing. Ugh, trees. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to go level Rusty a little bit. And, you know, I think... Oh, yeah, we got another one. Let's get up here because I can't really see. This is a bear. I want to check out this bear. Don't go behind the rock, bear. Come on, bear. There you are. Don't be a rock there. Don't be... Oh, man. Come on, bear. What is your level? There's not any more rocks there. Why is it not showing me your level? Because I'm a noob. That's why. Level 40. Oh, no, I'm not too interested. All right, guys. Well, like I said, I think it's time. I think we're going to go ahead and end it here. Rusty says, have a great day. Thank you all so much for joining us on this video. If you like this video, go ahead and give us a like. And if you want to see more like it, please subscribe. We really appreciate it. It's fantastic, all you guys subscribing. So thank you so much, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.